Hey guys, Ian from Eurogamer here. Eurogamer's news editor, Wesley Yin Paul, recently went to a Dragon Age Inquisition preview event in London, and he kindly brought me back this brand new gameplay footage of BioWare's new beauty. I've stolen a few choice paragraphs from his preview to read over this video, but if you'd like to read his full detailed piece, there is a link in the video description below. OK, so Bioware have announced that Dragon Age Inquisition will see the return of the tactical view from Dragon Age Origins. In Dragon Age Inquisition, the tactical view available on all platforms works as it did in Origins. You're able to pause combat and zoom out to a top-down perspective, issuing party members movement, ability and attack orders. The tactical view, which was ditched for the heavily criticised Dragon Age 2, lets players micromanage combat, enhancing the strategic element of encounters. Dragon Age Inquisition's normal view is a Mass Effect style third person perspective, which allows for action game esque combat. During the press event, Wes saw the player character, the Inquisitor, use powerful sword strikes to deal damage and a chain attack to drag foes towards him. As in previous games in the series, you're able to switch to control a party member at any time. Also added to the mix is limited environmental destruction. The example shown to Wes was inside a keep, where enemies were positioned behind cover on top of a bridge. Bioware paused the combat before issuing the Inquisitor an attack order, sending him charging towards the bridge's foundations. During combat, the Inquisitor brought down the bridge, killing the hard-to-reach enemies. If you haven't done already, please do subscribe to Eurogamer by clicking on that on-screen annotation. We'll have more Dragon Age Inquisition coverage in the near future, plus all the usual exclusive content. Oh look, a dragon!